Here's what she had to say about the package of bills that, that were approved by the House. This legislation follows our prior increases to fundings to the community-oriented policing program through the appropriations process. The Investor Protect Act would help get the job done of ensuring that police departments, particularly those like I represent in smaller and rural communities, have the ability to recruit and retain officers. This legislation invests in officer safety. It invests in domestic violence response training. It invests in funding the police departments like those I represent. Throughout Virginia's 7th District, I hear directly from local police departments about the need for stronger investments in training, equipment, recruitment, and retention. And as a former law enforcement officer, I greatly admire and am thankful for the ded dedication of men and women who work every day to keep our communities safe.